virtual reality, augmented reality, let's face it, this is reality. Thinking attended CES 2015, the Consumer Electronics Trade Show that's all about incorporating the tech of tomorrow into the products of today. What did we discover while we were there? Come along and find out. There are two trends in technology that I'm really interested in. In one, it plunges a person into a digital world. And in the other, it brings digital information to our physical world. I see these as two sides of the same coin. And one side is virtual reality, and the other is augmented reality. So let's start with virtual reality. Now the term VR got a bad rap when it first rose to prominence in the early 90s because the actual technology couldn't exactly live up to our expectations. But that's not true today, thanks to advances in displays, stereoscopic technology, head tracking, and low latency, which means we can actually experience that immersive environment the way it was intended. There is no better example of VR in the consumer space than the Oculus Rift. And here at CES 2015, we can see that for ourselves. I mean, just look at this booth. The line stretches around the corner to get in. I don't blame them. It's a really impressive technology that allows you to experience these virtual environments in the privacy of your own home. You can explore anything that someone has the imagination to bring to you. Now, if it weren't for my delicate constitution, I'd be wearing one of those right now, but Honestly, after a little bit, I get a little loosey-goosey in the stomach. Now, augmented reality, on the other hand, is all about bringing digital information and marrying it to the physical surroundings around us. This could be pretty simple, like holding up a smartphone to look at a building and see what its address is. Or it could be more complicated, like putting on a pair of glasses and looking at a movie poster and seeing the characters come to life right before your eyes. The point is, we can now enrich our actual physical surroundings with all this information that otherwise would remain ethereal. We can really marry those worlds of physical and digital. Okay, I've got a question for you guys this week. Which technology do you think is closer to maturity? Is it virtual reality or is it augmented reality? And have you had the experiences with VR or AR? I wanna hear about them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit like, subscribe to our channel, and then check out these other amazing videos. They will virtually blow your mind.